Hey FEF family, Wags here. Let me ask you a question. Do you have some sort of device that's supposed to be your personal assistant? Like, you could ask it questions, you could be like, oh, add this to my shopping list. But it kind of got lame, it kind of got boring. Like for example, hey Alexa, what's the sum of pi? The number pi is a mathematical constant representing the ratio of a circle's circumference to its diameter. You cannot calculate the volume or sum of a mathematical constant in isolation. And you can ask her dumb questions like that. But it doesn't really feel like a personal assistant, right? Alexa, what is the meaning of life? Eleanor Roosevelt said, The purpose of life is to live it, to taste experience to the utmost, to reach out eagerly and without fear, for newer and richer experience. Alexa, What's my name? I'm talking to Waxel. This is Waxel's account. Anyways, yeah, we got a personal assistant, but I feel weird talking to some cylindrical object that looks like the Earth. So I have an idea to give Alexa a new makeover. Hey Alexa, what's a makeover? The noun, makeover, can have a couple meanings. One. Remodeling, renovation, restoration. Two, a thorough course of beauty and cosmetic treatments. Hey Alexa, are you ready to be pretty? Sorry, I'm not sure. Oh, you will be sure once we give you the makeover. <laughs>
like that. On to the next step. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and cut the stencil. It doesn't need to be perfect. Pretty much the, the whole point of this was to um, cover up that hole. That was really the whole, the whole point. And you would think I would pick a better pair of scissors. No, that wasn't the case here. So, let's go ahead and cut this here. Boom. So we got the pieces cut out. We're gonna sandwich the main plastic piece together. I mean, it's not the best job, but no one's gonna see it anyway. So we're gonna hot glue this down. We got the hot glue gun sitting there getting ready to heat up. Let's go ahead and get ready to bling out the shock top. So we got these smart LED lights that's supposed to work from your Google Assistant and or uh, Alexa. So I guess that's the one of the wires. It's about 16 feet. We don't need 16 feet, obviously. We have the power cord as well. And instructions and mounts, which is we're not going to need unless some strange thing happens. But that's what's in the box. So I gotta figure out a way and how to uh, make the lights work in there. So we got 16 feet. So how I was thinking about doing it is if you look inside the pumpkin, I was gonna start from the back, go around to the front and to the back, up like a horseshoe, around this way, and come across. But I was also thinking coming from the back, going to the front, around, up like this, around like this, and back down, and leaving it like that. So I think that's the way we're gonna do it. If the stars align, I should be able to get this done. Hopefully. All right. Let's get this masking tape off and let's get ready for uh, Lex's new body to go ahead and get ready to go. So look inside this pumpkin. My only concern is, as the sides are raised, one side is raised and the other one's uneven. So. I'm gonna try to do this the best of my ability, and the best thing I can just do it right now is just send it. Jesse's holding the uh, the round part, so let's go ahead and I just want to protect the pins. Hold on, maybe this is a, not a good idea right now, and the reason why it's not a good idea is. There's a very good reason. I want this to come out good. I want it to come out crappy. So I got to figure out because this piece is not going to sit here because we're going to have this part here. So we're going to. I guess it was just. But that's not how it goes. It originally goes like this. See what I'm saying? Yeah, but if I start up front, the pattern is going to be different now. So it's got to be, I got to, I guess, drill the hole. I don't know. We'll be back in a second once we figure it out. So we kind of ran into an issue. So I had to do the alternative. What ended up happening is when I went to put the black, uh, the brown stuff back on this, it ended up sticking to the white. So now the adhesive is gone. But I got a glue gun, so I'm gluing it to the inside, which is I think it's going to hold better anyway. But like I'm stressing out. Just as looking at me like I have six heads. I'm sitting here running like a madman. I'm like, this is not going to work. This sucks. My life. But, you know, if life hands you lemons... Make beef stew. All right. So as soon as I get this going, I'm, I need to not. 
it needs to be loose because if it's tight, it's going to pull. And I don't want it to pull. And I'll show you more on the inside. Just let me get this main base done. Because this is foam and the glue is already melting the stuff to it. Like I already screwed up here. So my apparently my neighbor is moving and he's getting rid of some stuff and my uncle wants to go take a look at it. Hopefully this holds, please, for the That hurts so bad. Whoa, 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 time out, guys, time out, time out. We're gonna take a brief moment away from the video because I'm talking to you, yes, you. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and make sure you leave a comment so I know that you guys are watching and I can answer all the questions there. And make sure you hit that bell icon too so it'll notify you every time I upload because it's very important, guys. Now back to the video. Don't play with it, please. I'm holding it so it stays. All right, well, don't play with it, please. All right, so we'll be back as soon as I get more on the way on this. But, yeah, it's probably just a little bit more difficult than I anticipated. All right, we're back. We had to switch mics. Now, the issue is my lavalier kind of cut off for no reason. It, it had some charge, and it still has some charge, but it just cut off. So we switched to the DAD mic. So I don't know what audio was missed. But I was saying is stress on this because the adhesive, like I said, wasn't holding. So we had to use a glue gun. So but what we did was off camera is we checked the LEDs and the LEDs are still okay. So hold on, let's, let's pull this up. I think laying it down might be better. Not, not at this angle right here. Because what I'm going to do is right now I'm going to go long ways so that's why i think laying it down is going to be better going that way going down Sorry. all right well just Go. give it a second let me pull this out Ow. so now we just ran the glue uh glue gun through the pumpkin so it's a very very difficult process right now it requires all my concentration, power of will at this point. We'll just go to this point right here. So we're getting to the crucial spot where the LED now is going behind the pumpkin and we're gonna try to make it go up. So technically we're a quarter of the way in, but like we're <coughs> almost done at that same point in time. Yes, that's where we gotta go. So leave that gap there, go here. That's what I'm going to. This is no, that's fine. If one LED is covered, it's not a big deal. I prefer not to have any of the LEDs covered, but just in case this happens, it's not a big loss. The big loss would be is if I ruin one of the components by overheating it. Not saying I probably would. But hold the pumpkin. Hold the pumpkin. Look at Jesse taking over in control. Leaking. I know because it ran down. So let's go ahead and turn this over like this. Walk with it. Ow! Do you have any glue gum in your face? Glue gun, I mean glue sticks. So we're down to how many glue sticks left? Four? Five. Never reminding, never taking whatever you told me. I know what I could be Making the most impenetrable insights I will make Is this what you made me?
I think you're supposed to cut it where the white ends. Alrighty, so we finished, we cut the wire. Oh, it looks really cool. It actually looks pretty cool. I like how it has the, the X in the one eye. Yeah, it looks really cool. It kind of looks like, um, that was an accident, actually. That kind of, it kind of looks like one of those, um, the masks from, um, I guess a purge, right? Yeah, so good. I think it did, I think we did good. I think so too. I think it lights up good. Did you see? Yeah, you can still see it in the camera. I think it, like, it does really well. So, to show you the glue job and the botch job, I'll show you. Unplug it. I don't know if you could see it. But yeah, it, it was it was very difficult. Very difficult. And there's still some spots I'm going to hit up with the glue gun. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick to make sure it stays. I want to hit here. Oh, thank God we have one more glue gun. One more glue. That's it. But I think it should hold. Now on to the fun part, which is not really so fun. Now we got to wire everything. So let's go ahead and unplug this. Do we have Alexa with us? Yes, we do. Is she in the box? Yes, she is. <coughs> is she okay? Don't know. Probably not because she's not plugged in. Alexa should run off batteries. Should. Alright, so we need to plug it in. We're going to need to glue this. And the reason why we're gluing this is because we're going to attach Velcro to this so Alexa's Velcroed in. So I'm going to need to plug in the hot glue gun again. This is the last one. All right, so we got to make do with what we got, right? Yep. So I don't think we'll need a ton. I just need to glue uh, a couple of points, to be honest. So we'll glue. It's already cooled down, so. We might need to give it a minute, too. Send it. I'm just gonna send it. Alright. One's gonna go there. There's only like two holding this down. I'm not gonna screw this one all the way because I don't wanna. No, I don't think we need to screw them all the way. No, but I need to screw it so it's snug. Yeah, and so it stays, so it doesn't slip off. It's just to hold the plate on. Mm -hmm. That's it. Now, let's hook up Alexa. Pick this back upstairs and see it in action. We're back in the room. What do you guys think? I think we did an amazing job. And the fact that uh, the pumpkin head, or Fred, we're going to call We're going to call him Fred now. I can control the lights however I want. So, for example, uh, if we want to probably get a better angle. Hey, Alexa, turn the volume up to 25%. So we turned the volume up to 25%. Now Alexa, right now we have the, the lights going with the music because I have it on my phone. But now check this out. Hey Alexa, uh, change the color to red please. Sorry, what's your price? LED strip. Did you mean pumpkin head? Yes, pumpkin head. Okay. Hey Alexa, change pumpkin head to red. Okay. Hey Alexa, change pumpkin head to green. Okay. See, and it just makes it more interesting. Hey Alexa, tell me a joke. 
Why did the wizard get a job as a cook? Don't know. Because he was good at salting. But anyways, guys, I hope you like the DIY videos. I really do enjoy doing them. This one we had a little trouble. But again, it's not like you could buy this in the store, so we kind of had to wing it. I enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed it. And Fred's going to end up... Alexa. He's going to like her new makeover as soon as we bring her on the bus. Alexa, what's my name? I'm talking to Axel. This is Axel's account. Damn right it is. And I'll see you guys in the next video. You guys have a good one.